Since creation, food has been part of human life and essential to growth. As the saying goes, food is how you make it, if only it's edible. Africa is the home of varieties as far as food is concerned, but one of them seems to be dominant. Fufu is its name and it is well known in most parts of Africa. It is mainly served with hot soup as dinner. Ghana is the hub of fufu. Almost every household enjoys fufu on a daily basis. Our research indicates that 7 out of 10 people will choose fufu as favorites in West Africa. Not long before, fufu was pounded using a mortar and a pestle with a driver and a pounder. Usually, cassava, plantain, yam or cocoa are the main ingredients of pounding fufu. The highest demand for fufu has forced the Ghanaian creative industry to create a fufu pounding machine. This machine is meant to reduce stress in preparing the food. We visit Michael Safo an electric welder at Kumasi Swami magazine to take us through the manufacturing process. Apart from the engine, all the other parts are built here in Ghana from guarded metal scraps. Me, me electric radar. First, we say no. Now, for any home crown, but first class, I could have a honor as a whole summer. No crown, I hope a friend is there. When you borrow bomber, no mamma with full crown on Peso Bedding or Beba, and only a chance young who say, I will say, I'm sure you be a bit me a boy any young for no Nibia, any panoco people for no Zuniba or Bedded just a cock of fruit. Biba, Nana, my mamma, but did not attempt to say, nay, it's me, your machine be saying, I say, or Bano be to be no the choir. The machine has become a very lucrative business of which most of the Ghanaian population depend on. To some Ghanaians, they think the machine can harm them one way or the other. Others also think the old way of preparing is delicious 
than grinding with a machine. Media, fufua ye one ni ke ye yam ni mi ke ni ka me ni ni mo ye one team team ano na mepe. Mampo ane ya bi machine e na di na e kasa u e ni ya na e kasa u na di na o ko di ya se e chia e chino e di na me ni ni mo e chino na di ni chini go e ube fuma ube ni ni mo ube fuma e mbo e bet ma ni ni e ube fuma. Some also think that the mortar and the pestle has been a hub of antiquated bacteria. I took a, a, a personal vow years ago that I'll, I'll stop eating fufu. I stop eating fufu. Not that I don't like it, I like it. Not for health reasons, but for annoyance reasons. <laughs> Any food that if you have to eat, you have to punish yourself this way to eat. I said, I said what, what is the sense in this? What is the sense? And the anointing, when you're sweating, your sweat is going into the thing. You are mixing sweat. And all kinds of now you don't even know and and even the the mortar there are all kinds of dry fufu in the corners all kinds of all kinds of bacteria this uh, this is an ecosystem for bacteria five years of bacteria we're still pounding the thing in there and people say this is what we like because you know Africans we don't know what kills us. The thing is killing us, but we say it's a witch. It's a, it, you know, so, we, because we never identify objectively where our problem is, it's, it's a witch somewhere. So, somebody poisoned him. So, this, this happened, but we never come to think of it. This fufu we've been pounding in this mortar, which is not sanitized and has left over things in the corners, which becomes breeding grounds for all kinds of bacteria. What impact does it have on our life? I don't think we've researched that. stainless steel. We say, so we go hospital. We are not supporting any other people. We are stainless. We go hospital and pour more gas. We move BBI is stainless. And I'm saying, no, I know no any nothing. And no, and nothing. And I'm a yeah, and no, a yeah, pain. No, send your baby. You couldn't find your mom. And yeah, no, when you are not any day. And how no? And I win in sooner. Hey, I'm no. Win in the shaft. No. Me and Kasamini say, you free to sing in a no. I dear yes silver. Ah, you chimu ye no more be an idea. Yen an anumina did you be pay. Ye fis a da sang, ye come banku, a mutu ya the young quine ni mabi bre. Aha, da sang say ya dialo me, enna a ye da sang, and I'm say ye di dia mua uncle papro be bianya day, and menti, and ye dear lumini bayano, send ye baya and handy panel empty, we no and ya da de aye alumi, and ye anani. Alumino, any idea Modu Sadway, send a bit near Yampo Fulu, and Umpuno, a Kuni Payama, and go for problem behind a day. Ah, man, a bar, a hand and soa, we know who is a hand, and yet I didn't mean that I didn't be catching on any, and a motor, we electric motor, and the Aponetama, Motonu, the left, and the motor near Jumano. Now we know so, Shafton, and my 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 Challenge back by you, you can be a buy about my and about my young can say, a movie. Young can say, a shafter, a young can say, 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 a young
Yeah, <laughs> Ne <laughs> Our main question is, what will the future of this indigenous delicacy be? Fufu, best food in Africa. Fufu, no Follow us on all social media platforms and subscribe to our pages for more documentaries.